All right, well, this is the uh, Ontario SP5 uh, Survival Bowie. Uh, I've had this knife for four months, all right, and um, this is how the coating has uh, held up here. Now, I have used this knife quite extensively, and it, it's actually a pleasure to use. I have to say, for its price, which is relatively inexpensive, uh, you get a tremendous knife. Now, through all the use that I've put this through, I do have a little bit, and you may, might not be able to hear it. Maybe you can hear that. Slight wobble in there, little, little uh, in, in the handle here. Um, I don't believe that this uh, lanyard tube here is, is loose at all. I think there is just a slight gap uh, in the mold. And I noticed that from the start, and I can compare it to another one of my Ontario knives. So this isn't a review because, as I said, I like to have things at least a year, if possible, uh, to, to uh, you know, actually bring you a good, honest review. You know, let, let the honeymoon period sort of uh, disappear. But this is relatively simple, and there's a lot of different videos uh, on YouTube uh, involving this. But I uh, have people ask, how do I strip one of my knives? So I figured I would do it because this is in need of it. As you can see, we have a lot of, like, you know, uh, wood debris and stuff, uh, in, you know, stuck on there. And um, I don't like really using coated blades for food prep. Uh, there's just something not really clean about it to me, and... Who knows what this stuff here is? Um, you know, <laughs> nothing I would want to eat if I can help it. So uh, be careful. Obviously, there is slight wind today, just a slight breeze, but uh, I don't really intend to get a lot of this on the handle uh, if possible. So basically, what we're going to do here is just uh, set this on. And uh, this is just some spray on stripper. I found that I, that I like it better. than uh, some of the other ones, some maybe that you would paint on for the knife application. This is real easy to direct, and it's not sloppy, and I don't have to dirty a, a uh, you know, a brush or a, you know, pad or anything like that. So basically, that'll sit there for um, X amount of time. And uh, I mean, just read the label. I, I want to say this ends up having to stay on there for 15 minutes or something like that. Uh, you know, whatever it is, usually 15 minutes, I'll scrape some off and there'll still be maybe a little bit of trouble spots on there. And so I'll do another coating again. So plan on taking an hour out of your life to, to, to strip your knife. But this here, uh, basically is, uh, all that's done. So, um, as I said, you can take a putty knife or a razor blade and you can scrape this all down.